Welcome to Revit MB course. In this session, we will learn how to make cleaning for the drone. Cleaning is very important to make it very, to make the size small for the drone. So it will not affect the performance of the Revit. Okay, so first of all, I need to write, I need to draw one intersection between any two grid to be as a reference for me. To be reference that I will adjust the origin from it and then you can now remove the architecture and the structure so here you can make delete for all of this okay now this drone became very very small so I will make save so it is saved already you will save or you can make save as to be in another file but now we will uh, put it inside the drone insert link add. so with the same procedure you will make it lighting here and make open so it will be inserted but without the background without the architecture and the structure background so it will not be heavy and it will not affect it will not affect the performance of the app. also here i will make bin unbin and move from this intersection that I did to the intersection here okay and you can choose yes yes this is the intersection and you can make bin okay I put the drawing now it is it is more easy to start the modeling okay here I will start by this room these six lighting fixtures and I will make systems and from here lighting and I will choose the same lighting that F1 that we inserted already and here make sure that this is placed on face okay and then you will start to boot but here it is done but it needs some adjustment so you can use from here align so here align from this and this okay then you can make copy or you can make insert again whatever you want you can okay but here the uh, drawing is not is actually is not matching with this so we will make here a line you can make a line here or move just this distance to be adjusted so uh, it is bent yes so we must uh, make unbend first and then move it to match with the tile so it must be matched with the tile okay then here we will move these two lighting to adjust on the new position from move and here it's very important to detect this difference from beginning because you you can detect this issue in the beginning it will be easy for you to uh, modify okay then you can take both of them as a copy from this point to tab this point then tab this point so i did the lighting we can make 3d for this lighting to see what happened so here i will make selection box from here and then start to see the 3d okay now the lighting is in the ceiling and it's okay now it's okay you can increase the section box to see the walls yeah yes so now we put the lighting and the ceiling and it is correct and it's very important to make sure that you put the lighting in the correct elevation and in the correct position to make sure in the 3d okay instead of continue if you did something wrong and you continue very uh, big area you will have issue so after you finish one room or two rooms you must start to check them in the 3d like this so it is okay okay thank you very much